it's a developmental pathway that it that's highly mutated in colorectal cancer. So that's something you know, APC um, is thought to be um, very operative in colorectal cancer for that reason, <clears throat> um, because of the Went pathway. Then uh, stem cell components are thought to be very much regulated by Went. So. Um, you know, it's almost like the sky's the limit in terms of the different types of tumors, but because of the high degree of mutation of the pathway in colorectal cancer, then that's one place that it's going. Another place that people are really interested in is pancreatic cancer, which has a big stem cell component. Um, so the problem has been that it's a very, very redundant, complex pathway. And so it's not going to be as easy as saying, oh, th if we have this mutation, then, you know, this means that we're going to have dramatic effects with this drug because there's so much redundancy in the system that uh, it's going to be hard to just target one part. So what's going to happen, I think, is it's most likely going to be used in combination. So for a stem cell regimen, you would basically come in with chemotherapy to sort of debulk the tumor and then give the stem cell targeted WENT inhibitor uh, to get more of a durable response and eradicate stem cells that often repopulate later on. If you're looking at more of a um, colorectal cancer strategy, then one of the things we've been studying is hitting the MEK pathway plus, plus the WENT pathway.